Hi I'm Vivek you are watching Dr. Vivek Scientific. The camel is used for several purposes for which its role is essential. It is used as a beast of burden for transporting goods and people as well as for providing milk. Milk is often the only regular food source for its owners. The camel's meat, wool and leather are also widely utilized. Camels have long been domesticated and, as livestock, they provide food, milk and meat, and textiles, fiber and felt from hair. Camels are working animals especially suited to their desert habitat and are a vital means of transport for passengers and cargo. There are three surviving species of camel. Camel is an even-toed ungulate in the genus Camelus that bears distinctive fatty deposits known as humps on its back. Camels have long been domesticated and, as livestock, they provide food, milk and meat, and textiles, fiber and felt from hair. Camels are working animals especially suited to their desert habitat and are a vital means of transport for passengers and cargo. Camels can be aged up to seven years while llamas and alpacas can be aged up to five years. The camel has 22 milk teeth and 32 permanent teeth. It is different to other ruminants in having two front teeth in the upper jaw. These humps give camels their legendary ability to travel up to 100 desert miles without water. Camels rarely sweat, even in desert temperatures that reach 120 degrees Fahrenheit, so when they do take in fluids they can conserve them for long periods of time. Camels are pregnant for 12 to 14 months. A mother can even stop mid-labor and hold on to her baby for weeks if she feels it isn't the right time. For the most recent data available in 2018, the total number of camels recorded in the world was 35,525,270 FAOSTAT 2020. In 1961, date of the first available data, 60% of the 38 national entities declared official data. The total camel population at that time was assessed to stand at 12,926,638 heads. The female becomes restless, the vulva is swollen and she will separate from the other animals. Birth commences with the appearance of the water bag followed by the two front legs and the head. The camel was also a vital element in the daily life and the culture of the Bedouin. It was his chief source of food, raw materials, transport and wealth. But camels need to withstand blistering heat and freezing cold so they store their fat away from their body to keep them cool in the summer and rely on a super thick coat for those minus 40 c desert winters. If you visit the safari in the summer and the winter you'll see the incredible change in our camels. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe.